The international supply chain has never been crazier. That's why if you sell on Amazon, you'll want to learn about Amazon's new global logistics dashboard. Hi, my name is Matt Davis, and I'm an account director here at My Amazon Guy. And if you're wondering what the global logistics dashboard is, it's effectively just a new tool that Amazon offers to its sellers to use their existing listings and existing FBA inventory and effectively clone that process to sell in new marketplaces, i.e., if, I, if you're in Amazon US to sell in Amazon Europe, to sell in Amazon Asia or Japan or North Africa. So if you're interested in that process to sell to more customers and more markets, start with your inventory tab from your homepage and drop down to sell globally. This is the global dashboard, right? It's gonna show you some basic information across what you're doing in current marketplaces and there's a tab for each. If you're new to selling internationally on Amazon, particularly if you're new to selling internationally entirely, I highly recommend that you start with this tutorial across the top. Understanding the basics is gonna allow you to know, at least from an Amazon perspective, some of the things that you'll need to get started with creating Amazon listings. This is not intended to be an entirely comprehensive thing. You can help you set up your account. It'll let you know what you need in terms of taxing and regulation, whether your products are eligible, and your listing and pricing strategies. Building international listings is the next one I would visit. And this will just help you manage listings and inventory across multiple marketplaces. Now for me right now, this is just looking at uh, Amazon North America because that's the only place that this account is currently set up and actually active. But it would give me opportunities to run across, uh, to manage across all these different marketplaces uh, if I had additional ones set up. And then for finding a provider, this is highly valuable. Again, particular if you're new to selling internationally, you can see there's a variety of services, everything from account management to international shipping and taxes. So to get started, you just come back to the dashboard once you think you're ready and you have everything you need and you'll go and create a marketplace. Now I've actually already started the process here with Amazon UK, so I'll jump over to that example. So as you can see here, this is just a walkthrough. It's pretty intuitive. You'll walk through, you'll need your business information, your seller information, payment information, um, and store name information. Um, payment information, if you are already established with Amazon, um, you should be able to, if you want to, just use the existing payment information on file. Um, and transfer that. You can even pay for your new account setup through any available funds in that account. That should get you started. If you have any questions, please feel free to visit our YouTube channel, the My Amazon Guy YouTube channel, or feel free to visit us at myamazondiaga.com for coaching or consultation anytime. Thank you so much for watching. We appreciate you.